Welcome to the Wasteland News Network. Fair warning, this episode takes place inside the public test server and does contain story spoilers. As you can see briefly, the sign that was up there, uh, Giuseppe's Curios. Giuseppe is a new vendor at the White Spring Refuge. And yes, Bubbles is still here. I know a few people were asking if Bubbles still had her little vendor shop for colas uh, at the uh, White Spring. And yes, she does. She's right beside Giuseppe. Uh, when you finish expeditions, you are rewarded with a new currency called stamps, and you can come here to trade in your stamps for select plans and other things. So let's have a look at what Giuseppe has to offer. Ah, a customer here to Peru or buy. Either way, prepare your eyes for a feast of the senses, huh? A spectacle like a Noah. Oh, I got a bit carried away, didn't I? <laughs> For not to properly introduce myself, Giuseppe della Ripa, at your service. Tradesman and curio collector, welcome to Giuseppe's Curios. Buy, sell, trade, and count. I'm a collector of oddities and eccentricities, and I sell those eccentricities for the right price. Perhaps I might have something to your liking. Oh, I've called many places home. Clarksburg, New York, now Appalachia again. But none ring truer in my heart than the homeland. Italia! Ah, I believe in your language. It is simply Italy. I was born there. I remember very little of it. There's still a connection. I think there's something that binds you to where your ancestors are from. It may not make sense if you've been raised in a place your family has always had roots in. Ah, don't mind me. I'm just rambling at this point. What makes it worse is knowing I can never go back. That, and not knowing what Italy's fate was after the bombs, who knows what it looks like now? Fame and fortune. <laughs> or maybe just fortune. Hmm. Okay, let's have a quick look at what Giuseppe is selling for stamps. Uh, for the first four, we have Auto Axe, Burning Mod, Electrified Mod, Poisoned, and Turbo. I have a feeling Turbo might be the best. A Fanatic Barricade, a Pump Action Shotgun Paint, Pittsburgh Floodlights, Street Kits, City Limits, Signs, Tinkers, Goggles, and Overalls, Trench Runners Coat and Hood, a Trog Tube, Union 42 banners and the blood cleansers, calibrated shocks, that's all of these things are very similar, if not exactly the same, as the mods we get for power armor, the other ones. Uh, Union hunting rifle skin, uh, that was one that got snuck in there. Medic pump, that's normal. Motion assist servos, bracers, more servos. Okay, reactive plates. Recon sensors, rusty knuckles, all for power armor. All of these are for power armor. Let's see if there's anything else. They kind of snuck that uh, that one rifle paint in there. And that is the end of the list. On average, it seems to be about 85 stamps. So there's a quick look at what Giuseppe is selling. Thanks so very much for watching, and I'll see you out in the pit.